Hey guys, it's Paul from icegatecoach.co.uk. Here's a quick video for anyone who's just recently bought rollerblades who are figure skaters. So we're going to look at exercises and some drills to help you transfer from blades to wheels. Some of the clips here today are taken from a live lesson with a collaboration with Ice Coach Online and Lloyd Jones Coach jumping in to give some commentary. So let's start with warm ups. So in our first warm up exercise, the first thing I like to do is do some half lemon, half swizzle pumps around in a figure of eight so I get both sides. Now the aim of this is to figure out how hard I can push before my wheels slip because the wheels don't grip quite as well as the blades would on the ice. So this is really just for me to get a gauge of how hard I can push. And the same can be said about edge pressure. So using a half circle for an edge, I'll do two pushes in between, followed by the inside edge. So two pushes, outside edge one end, let's bend a knee as I come round, and inside edge the other end. And then of course I change direction and do it the other side. So again I'm just getting used to how much I can bend my knee to put the pressure on the edge without the wheels slipping. So I'm just gauging, I'm calibrating how hard I can bend and push into the edge. And it goes without saying that slaloms or any kind of edge work are going to be really good warm up for you. So here one foot slalom, forwards and of course backwards as well. Okay, here's a nice drill for crossovers on rollerblades. Okay, one more look at Paul here. Now watch this, he's holding that outside edge, hold the inside. He changes circle here, outside edge, inside edge, and now he's gonna change back. So this is, now he's on circle one, outside edge, inside edge and hold. Now he does inside circle two starts, outside edge, inside edge, hold. Now he changes to circle one again, okay? So there's always two circles you turn around. And this drill can also be done backwards as well. So one backward crossover, pull the edge around, wide step, and one backward crossover the other way in a figure of eight pattern. Again, really good to fit both of these in a small area if that's all you've got to work with. Great way to practice your crossovers on rollers and get used to them. Okay, here's a nice exercise for your mohawks. So these two variations of this one, you can do a mohawk, a backward crossover, step forward, and then a mohawk the other way. So this drill's designed to be fit into a small space. You can even take that back crossover out of it, forward crossover into mohawk, step forward into the next crossover, mohawk. So that is all it is guys, forward crossover mohawk, step forward, forward crossover mohawk. This helps you get really tight edges and get used to those wheels for your mohawks as well as your stepping forwards. Okay, here's a great drill for your three turns on rollerblades. So we're gonna do an outside three turn, step forward straight into another outside three turn. Now you can see how I'm pulling this round and making it fit a very small space. So these can progress down the, the space that you have. Uh, or they can come right back round and you can keep these within a very small area so it's very good for a small space. Three ways to stop on rollerblades. The first one is a step step. So here we're going to turn your blades to the side and take two steps. Now don't go into this too fast or you will trip over. Then of course there's a classic T-stop, making a T-shaped letter with your feet and you can drag those back wheels along. Just be careful not to drag them too hard. And the last one is a two-footed lunging swoop around and this will just take out your speed without wearing out your wheels. Okay, let's look at spins. So probably the easiest way to start is from a pivot and then lift up onto one foot. What you're going to feel on rollerblades is that you're dragging your toe stop a lot more than you would drag your pick on the ice, but the aim is still to make small circles as you do your spin. A little look at jumps on rollerblades. Until you get used to three turning at speed on wheels, I found using a mohawk much easier for toe loop and salco. And the loop just had to keep that a little bit slow until you can trust the edge and how much you drag the toe. For flip, I would start with this prep where you're just getting used to hitting your toe stopper and landing on one foot before you're ready to try the whole thing. If you've got a little bit of fear about your axle on wheels, try these little drills. We start with big three jumps so you can get really used to the takeoff. 
then a 360 to forward on two feet, followed by a one foot takeoff to the same two foot landing. The next step, once you're forward on two feet on your wheels, would be to do a right inside three turn and cross your leg to, to pretend you've landed. Okay, so you're gonna land like this. In this clip I was demonstrating how you land on two feet and you can finish backwards. So you land forward and then right inside three turn. And then cross the leg just to get the same feeling. And yeah. That's it. Try and cross your left leg in front on your three turn so you can get a feel of staying wrapped. There you go guys, thanks for watching. I hope that's helped. Big shout out to Lloyd Jones from Ice Coach Online. Make sure you check out his channel on YouTube and his profile on Instagram. And don't forget to check me out too on all the socials. If you found the video helpful, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks again guys.